Welcome. In today's video, I'll go through a Cardano decentralized exchange to watch out for as Cardano introduces smart contracts tomorrow. I'll leave any relevant links in the description below. First of all, what is Cardano trying to achieve? If you have never come across Cardano in the crypto world, it is a blockchain technology looking to solve blockchain and real world problems. There are many projects based on the blockchain who introduce their technology at a much more rapid pace. Cardano has taken a slow and steady approach to develop its sustainable ecosystem. The team behind the project focus on core technology, in-depth research and development, hardcore testing, economic identity and much more before launching live on the mainnet. So what does the upgrade mean? The upgrade will allow smart contract capabilities, meaning developers can now run decentralized applications such as DEXs on top of the Cardano blockchain. A DEX will allow a user to swap, stake, lend, borrow and more. For example, once the DEX goes live, user 1 will be able to trade token A with user 2 holding token B. So what problems will be solved? With DEXs built on top of Cardano, they can solve problems such as number 1. Low transaction fees. If you have ever experienced purchasing an NFT from OpenSea or swapping a token on Uniswap, then you would realize the fees are highly dependent on network activity, meaning if there are many users transacting, the fees are remarkably high. In the real world, you can compare this to Uber. If there is a high demand in orders in a certain location, the fees to request an Uber increase in price. As you can see, if you were to transact on the 7th of September at approximately 10 p.m., when Bitcoin had a quick flash crash, you could pay up to 1,009 GUI for one transaction. Depending on the gas fee, that would equal to approximately anywhere between $300 to $500 or more. For one transaction, that is insane. Cardano fees are remarkably low, with estimates of approximately 0.17 ADA per transaction, which equals to approximately $0.40 cents in relative to Cardano's price at the time of this video. Number 2. No fees for failed transactions. Sometimes when executing a transaction on DEXs built on Ethereum, the transaction could fail based on a few factors, such as if there is not enough fees to cover the smart contract. So just imagine when having a failed transaction on Ethereum when gas prices are at their peak, meaning you would have to pay double if you really want to go ahead with the trade. Cardano eliminates this problem. If a transaction fails, they have introduced a two-phase approach so that the user is not charged. So what DEXs are there to watch out for? There are currently successful DEXs built on alternative blockchains such as Uniswap and PancakeSwap. These platforms see millions of users over time, with prices of their native tokens on the rise. There are a few competitors looking to take some of this market share, which will be built on the Cardano blockchain, such as Polyswap, Ardana, Cardax and more. A strong competitor in my opinion who have been on top of their game are SundaySwap. With rapid growth to their community, providing weekly updates on their development, they are in the front line to provide a platform to cater to the market. They have been recognized by the founder of Cardano and have been transparent with their community along their journey. If you are looking to expand your portfolio and consider this project, my personal opinion would be to dig deeper into the company, watch the market, keep track of the amount of users flowing into the website, and monitor websites such as DeFi Station to keep track of the total dollar value locked within the project. Once the token is made available to the public, I will create a video on how you can purchase the token. Once again, this is not investment advice, this is informative content to provide an outlook on an upcoming project. I hope you found this video useful. If so, please do give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you want to, and stay tuned for more crypto and mining content. Thank you all for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.